Today's story is two stories. I have two grandchildren who were born on the same day. Happy birthday, Dev. Happy birthday, Parker. And happy birthday to anyone else whose birthday it is today. I'm going to be reading Froggy's Birthday Wish by Jonathan London and illustrated by Frank Remkovich. And there was an old lady who swallowed a birthday cake by Lucille Colandro, illustrated by Jared Lee. Let's get started with Froggy's Birthday Wish. It was the night before Froggy's birthday, and Froggy was excited. Look, the moon, cried Froggy. It looks like an orange pinata. And Froggy made a birthday wish. And if you don't know what a pinata is, don't worry, you'll find out. Then he got dressed. Zip, zoop, zup, 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 zap. And flopped into the kitchen. Flop, flop, flop. Are we having something special? Asked Froggy. Oh, no, dear. Why do you ask? Oh, I don't know, said Froggy. Are you doing anything special today, Dad? Um, not really. Why do you ask? Then Froggy turned to Polly. Well, what do you have to say, Polly? Poo-poo on you. <laughs> Froggy ate his bowl of cereal and flies and wondered, what if my family forgot my birthday? Froggy, called his mom. What? Shoo, shoo, go out and play. Poor Froggy, what if his family did forget his birthday? Do you think they forgot? So Froggy flopped over to Max's, flop, 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 and banged on the door. Max, Max, he shouted. But nobody was home. Oh, no, cried Froggy. What if Max forgot my birthday? Then he went over to Matthew's, but nobody was home. Oh, no, cried Froggy. What if Matthew forgot my birthday? Then he went over to Travis's, but nobody was home. Oh, no cried Froggy. What if Travis forgot my birthday? So he dragged himself home, zloop, wondering, what if everybody forgot my birthday? So much for my birthday wish. Hmm. When he finally got home, Froggy opened the door. Surprise! Froggy almost jumped out of his skin. Zing! Everybody was there. Max, Matthew, Travis, even Frogalina. And my granddaughter Parker, she loves Frogalina. Frogalina said, I bet you were worried that everybody forgot your birthday. Not me, said Froggy. Froggy still had hopes for his birthday wish, but first... He and his friends played pin the tail on the donkey. Froggy almost pinned the tail on Max's mother's bottom. Oops! Arf! laughed Doggy. Now it was time for the birthday cake. And here came Mom with all the candles burning. And everybody sang. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Froggy. Happy birthday to you. This was the moment Froggy had been waiting for. He made his wish, took a big breath, and blew out all the candles. Whoosh! After they gobbled down the cake, Mom announced, Time to open presents! First, Froggy ripped open a present from Max, with a little help from Doggy. A skateboard! 
he shouted and hopped on. Zoom! Crash! He knocked over the punch bowl. Oops! said Froggy. Then he ripped open a present from Matthew. A scooter! he shouted and hopped on. Zing! Crash! He nearly knocked over the fish bowl. And then he ripped open a present from Travis. A pogo stick! he shouted and hopped on. Boing! 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 and hit his head on the ceiling. Bonk! and fell down. But he still hadn't got his wish. What do you think his birthday wish is? Finally, Frogalina said, I have a surprise for you, Froggy. Close your eyes. And what do you think she gave him? A big, fat pinata, like an orange moon. Yippee! cried Froggy, and he sang, I got my wish! I got my wish! Froggy! called Dad. What? Come out and hit your pinata! So Froggy flopped outside, flop, 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 and Dad hung the pinata from the tree and tied a bandana over his eyes. Then Froggy swung the bat and missed. Zwish! He swung again. Zwish! And on his third swing, whack! The piñata flew up, 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 then dropped down, 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 and burst open on Froggy's head. Zblat! Oops! cried Froggy, looking more red in the face than green. Candy! Candy! yelled Frogalina. Candy for everyone! And everyone dived in, even Doggy. Well, I got my wish, cried Froggy. And it was filled with chocolate-covered flies. Yum! Munch, crunch, munch. Nom, nom, said Polly Wagalina, stuffing her face with candy. Happy And everybody laughed. Oh, oh. Even Doggy. I hope you liked that birthday treat, because here's another one. There was an old lady who swallowed a birthday cake. There was an old lady who swallowed a cake. I don't know why she swallowed a cake. It was a mistake. There was an old lady who swallowed a candle. It was easy to handle that sparkling candle. She swallowed the candle to light up the cake. I don't know why she swallowed the cake. It was a mistake. There was an old lady who swallowed a sign. It went down just fine, that colorful sign. She swallowed the sign to decorate the candle. She swallowed the candle to light up the cake. I don't know why she swallowed a cake. It was a mistake. There was an old lady who swallowed balloons. Her favorite cartoons were on the balloons. She swallowed the balloons to lift the sign. She swallowed the sign to decorate the candle. She swallowed the candle to light up the cake. I don't know why she swallowed a cake. It was a mistake. Oh my, what is she swallowing now? There was an old lady who swallowed a hat. It wasn't flat, that fun party hat. She swallowed the hat to put on the balloons. She swallowed the balloons to lift the sign. She swallowed the sign to decorate the candle. She swallowed the candle to light up the cake. I don't know why she swallowed a cake. It was a mistake. 
Oh, look what she's swallowing now. There was an old lady who swallowed confetti. She was very ready to swallow confetti. She swallowed confetti to spruce up the hat. She swallowed the hat to put on the balloons. She swallowed the balloons to lift the sign. She swallowed the sign to decorate the candle. She swallowed the candle to light up the cake. I don't know why she swallowed a cake. Sing it with me. It was a mistake. There was an old lady who swallowed some gifts. They were hard to lift, but she swallowed those gifts. Then with excitement, she shouted, Hooray! Her friend showed up and started to sway. And without any further delay, they all cheered. Happy birthday! Happy birthday, Parker and Dev. I love you. And happy birthday to anyone else who is celebrating a birthday today.